Indeed. Welcome back, everybody. This is Eileen Warnos, your hostess, and we're back with one of my favorite Nintendo GameCube games. So, this game is called Wario World. I feel like this game hasn't gotten that many attention, and I'll explain later. Um, I already have two, you know, files saved, but obviously there's a new one for you guys. <laughs> so, let's get started. All right, story time, children. Pay attention. Long ago, there was an evil black jewel that fed on the wishes of people, turning their desires into power. This dark jewel gave birth to many evil spirits, who then tormented the good, the good, <laughs> the good creatures of the world. Then, just when it seemed like the evil spirits would overrun the land, the sprightlings of the sacred forest ensnared the black jewel and hid it away deep within their ancient ruins. But over time, these events were all forgotten, and one day a greedy treasure hunter stole the jewel from the ruins. And that's us, because we're, you know, it's Wario. Greedy fat ass. Oh, free at last! I'm chock full of power! I think I'll turn all this greedy sap's jewels into evil spirits. Bwah, ha, 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 ha. You know, because, you know, logically, jewels can't talk, right? Anyways, I'm sitting in my in my chair like an asshole, laughing because I'm rich, but I'm alone because nobody likes me, and I'm going crazy because you know I'm lonely in my big giant fat ass castle, sitting on my fat ass. You know everything's just falling apart, and then here comes the jewel with an eye and four dicks. Well, they're tentacles, but you know they look like dicks. And that's the intro. So here we go. Alright, so this treasure chest up ahead, that's where the jewel is. Normally you would think, oh let's go beat him up, but obviously it's locked inside the chest. So we have to complete these worlds, and this is world 1, which is kind of forest themed, very easy. So I'll just be explaining everything, you know, as we go. This, obviously, Greenhorn Forest is the first level. And there's a bunch of stuff that we need to collect. These are treasures that the jewel stole from us. So we need to collect eight for every level. And here's the boss stamp. Here's the heart fragment stamp, and here's the treasure stamp, meaning we collected all the treasures. And we gotta rescue the Spritelings. Now, for the fragments, I'll explain to the uh, I'll explain that whenever we get one. I mean, right now I just want to talk about something else. And let me just say, this level is really easy. So those of you saying, "Oh, you know, this game is easy," <laughs> well, just wait until we get into the fucking you know second world, and you'll be seeing a lot of tedious shit. And I'm gonna beat all you guys up, because you guys are so fucking ugly. Now we activated that switch, which is purple, or hot pink, whatever. Anyways, um, here we are, treasure chest for the Game Boy Advance, obviously. This game is obsolete, outdated. But, you know, nobody cares about that, because, um, it's fun, and I enjoy it, and I want to play it. So, if you have a problem, you can just X out, and I don't care. Anyways... Wario, hi, I've been waiting for you. I'm one of the Spritelings in the forest. I have really bad news. That evil black jewel you stole is sucking up all the negative greed energy swirling around the castle, blah 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 blah. Alright. So, um, the Spritelings, basically, all they do is explain to you what I just explained to you guys. So, um, whatever they have to say is not, is not really relevant to any of us, because I'm gonna be explaining those. Okay, collecting the hard fragments. Now, these things are like little pieces of statues of ourselves, and there's a certain amount for every level. And if we collect them all, we get, you know, our life gets extended. So, we get an, we get half a heart. Half a heart. And there's two for every world. So basically there's, um, three levels, actually two levels for every world, there's four worlds, and there's um, three bosses for every level. I mean, 
every world. What the fuck am I saying? I can't even talk. You know, whenever I try to multitask like this, it's not easy. So you guys are gonna have to deal with that. Anyways, let's eat the money, because apparently in this game, money is edible. No, don't get stuck there now. No! Right there. See? Just gobble, 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 gobble. Anyways, um, there's two levels per world, and each level has a boss, and then there's a final boss for every every um world. And it's just the boss levels. There's like no worlds. Like it's just randomly there. Anyways, um This game is not I don't think it's that popular and that's fine. You know. Um You'd have to be a true Wario fan in order to play this. Garlic, don't you love garlic? Delicious garlic restores health. Listen, you big oaf. If you got some the courage to take me on, I guess it's okay to sell you garlic. Now, this bitch sells you garlic for ridiculous amounts of money. And that restores a full heart. But usually, I don't have to buy any because you know, the game gives you free garlic in one of the treasure chests. Damn it! No, this is really annoying. See? Why are you falling? Quit falling, goddammit! No, it's not that hard. Alright, now these are red jewels. Every level has a certain number of jewels required to enter the boss lair. In this case, it's three. But every level has the same amount of jewels that you can obtain, so, um... I usually just try to get them all, because I'm perfectionist. I like to get everything. I'm a greedy bitch. So, we're gonna be collecting everything in this game. So, stick around! And mind you, it is not obligatory. It's something I like to do. Because I don't like, you know, leaving shit undone. Now, what the fuck? No, get up there, you motherfucker. Alright. Oh, are you serious? Wario, are you using the- okay. Again, this is garbage that you guys could learn all by yourself. Now, this game is- to some people it might seem like eh. But I love it. It's one of my favorites. You know, I never really played Mario games. I mean... I was always, you know, Wario or Legend of Zelda. The only Mario games I really did play were the Paper Mario series. But otherwise, I have not played any, any, you know, Mario games that aren't... I mean, why, why shouldn't Wario have his own, you know, line of fucking games? Why the fuck can I get up here? God damn it. You know, I'm busy talking, I don't even know what I'm doing. I think I stacked this in the wrong fashion. Anyways, um, yeah, we're gonna have to get out of here. I don't think this is how you do it. God damn it. So yeah, you know, I think Wario should have his own line of games. And, you know, these are way more creative, in my opinion. Alright. We have to make like a little staircase here. I don't even know. I'm just too busy, I guess, blabbering my mouth to even know what the fuck's going on. That awkward silence. Oh, I remember. You have to go on the opposite direction. There we go. God damn it. You know, I might have to cut this part. Well, it depends. If it's too long, I'll cut it. If it's under 20 minutes, I won't. Oh yeah, that's another thing. Um, I'm gonna try to make these 20 minutes or less. That's another fragment here. Um, one level equals a video. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Okay, these fuckers are dangerous, so... Oh, what the hell? So yeah, I'm gonna try to make one level per video. Including the boss battles. 
Now the boss battles are gonna be... I mean like the the final boss for every world. That's gonna be its own video. Just because I don't... It's gonna be too long, especially with the upcoming levels. They're really long and really tedious and difficult. And in most cases I'd have to go back and, you know, collect all that garbage. Anyways, I'm done blabbering. Let's go back to the game. So obviously we have, you know, a section here. We're gonna collect more of these stupid jewels and more of these fragments so we can get extra life. And it's hidden somewhere in all the- Oh god. Nope, nope, nope. Now oh, where is that thing? Oh, there it is. I see your little red period just swirling around. <laughs> all right, let's go. Now you're gonna see a lot of these prehistoric ass, you know, monsters. And every level has their own version of them, except for this world, because it's, you know, the beginning, the easy level. So this is the most basic thing. Now, from the second world on, they will have their own versions of these monsters. And you'll see what I mean later on. So, we activate the green... the... yeah, the green button for the treasure chests. There it is. Well, that actually wasn't that one, I don't think. Um, oh yeah, here's the one we activated. And there's eight treasures for every um, world. And like I said before, this looks really easy now, but um, yeah, just wait until we get to the second level. Well, not the second level, the second world. Ugh, I hate this fucking... I really dislike one, because this one you have to be at a certain angle, and I'm not all about that. Like, see what a fucking... Ugh. You guys see what I mean? Not cute. But you know... I'm a perfectionist. You gotta go for the red jewels. I mean, I'm already a fat ass that's greedy. Might as well just live up to, you know, the reputation. And here we get garlic. See, we don't have to buy from that stupid dumbass garlic man. He sells garlic for like ridiculous amounts of money. Yeah, 20 coins. Just wait until we get to the, like, the... You'll see. It gets really high. Alright. The cliffs and deep chasms. Alright. Whatever. Yeah, if you fall off the level, you get... spawns in into this really creepy shit. Hopefully I won't have to show you guys that. But if I do, then oh well. That's how it is. What can I say? And... No, 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 no. Yep, nope, not today. See, normally I would have to fall there, but nope, not this time. I was smart. Alright, so if you have an enough red diamonds, the stone doohickey blocking the way will vanish. If not, the bye-bye balloons can... Yeah, I don't need... See, like I said, I already explained this to you guys. So the amount required is three jewels for this level. It gets higher upon the progress, but before we go there, we're gonna collect everything, because obviously. I mean, we don't have to collect everything, you know, to beat the boss, but I want to, so... Yeah, thanks for the garlic, even though I didn't need it. Alright. So we activated the blue treasure, and we have the purple one. And I will be going over each treasure at the end of the game. Not, you know, during the game, because that's gonna take too long. At the end. And don't nag me. Okay. Alright. Alright. 
And whenever we collect all the fragments, you're gonna see this giant stamp just pop out of the screen like that. That means we collected everything. And the same thing goes for the treasures. And now this bitch over here. Some fat ass turtle. Prehistoric fat ass turtle. Up, oh, everyone's gonna die. Terrorists. Terrorist attack. Alright. Now we have one treasure to collect, and then we can go beat the boss. Here we go, we have all the treasures. Now we're gonna make sure we have everything, right? Eight treasures. We have all the sprite links, which are those little fuckers jumping down there, and we have all the red diamonds. Perfect. Alright, let's kick this guy's ass. Now this piece of shit over here is some cheap imitation of Hulk. Not impressive. Oh, you think you're so badass. Oh, wow. Now he's gonna chase you like a little, you know, like a little mad little child. He's gonna go and have a little temper tantrum because he didn't get his dick up his ass and he's mad because of that. So he's gonna have a little temper tantrum and he's gonna be, I guess, pounding his chest while he just chases you in circles. Nothing to it. All you have to do is just keep running. And if you get beat by this guy, then you are stupid. What the fuck? Okay, that was some cheap ass shot. I don't appreciate you fucking... Wow, that was so cheap. Oh well. It ends now, bitch. Alright, cough up the money. Cough it up. Yeah, give me that cash. And that's the end of that. And we get more money. Well, that's the end of the level. So, thank you guys for watching and subscribing if you have. And we're gonna save. See, that's a statue, and now we get an extra life. And now we have access to the second level. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later.